Hey guys, welcome to question MM271 of the Mass Methods Fortify Study Guide. So, uh, we've got this question, if the integral from 3 to 5 of f of x dx equals negative 2, then the integral from 5 to 3 of 6 plus 3 f of x dx is equal to what? Alright, awesome. So, first things first is to recognise that we have this information, so we're going to be able to use this later. Um, but what I'm going to say is, I'm just going to pretend that I kind of have this on this side. Uh, we're going to say that because there's a plus here, whenever we have these sort of questions, we want to separate them uh, into their separate components. So this is the same as the integral from 5 to 3 of 6 dx plus the integral from 5 to 3 of 3 f of x dx. Okay, so still the same thing. I've just separated them into their own components. So uh, from here, we can actually say that uh, we can actually derive, uh, we can actually integrate this normally, right? We we know we don't know what f of x is, so we're going to have to use this. But with six, we can actually just integrate that normally. So the integral of six is six x from three to five, and then we're going to add this three here uh, is a constant, so that can come out the front here, which means that we have three from five to three of f of x dx. Uh, subbing in these values here, we get six times three minus six times five. Uh, now, we know that the integral from 3 to 5 of f of x is negative 2, which means that the integral from 5 to 3 of f of x is the negative version of this, right? Because when we swap uh, um, terminals, we get the negative version of that, which means we get plus 3 times the negative version of this, which is just 2, okay? 6 times 3 is 18, 6 times 5 is 30, 3 times 2 is 6, which gives us negative 6. Uh, that gives us our answer of A. So guys, negative 6 is our final answer for this, uh, which is A. Uh, if you have any questions, as always, hit me up in the comments below. Uh, but otherwise, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.